Hello, and welcome to another video from Sustenance and Covering, the only YouTube channel you need to not only survive the current apocalypse, but actually enjoy it. And today, we're going to talk about mind control and the media. Um, I saw a video a while back talking about how just a small, maybe 20 companies run the entire media of the United States and how that was dangerous. In my mind, I always figure it cost me about $40 a month just to keep my internet connection so I can run this little TV show. So, and uh, with like Time Warner or uh, Disney, those companies it cost millions of dollars a day to keep that junk on the air. So obviously, you know, it don't matter if they got a million companies that's running the media. If it costs that much money to be producing TV shows, then probably can't trust too many of them at all anyway. But anyways, uh, those names, Time Warner, Disney, they on there, and I guess uh, what got me to wanting to make this video is yesterday, this family come over and they had a child, and we was all sitting around the table talking, and a child said she wanted to color and watch TV. So I went in there and turned the TV on, and she started hollering for Hannah Montana. And it, her shirt even said, right there, Hannah Montana on the shirt. And so, you know, I know that she's been affected. She's watched this show, so her parents went down and bought that shirt, and somehow that helps to keep Disney on the air. You know, her mind's been controlled to want that shirt. But I didn't think much more of it till uh, I walked in the room, I don't know, a half hour after that to get something. And she was sitting there watching that show. I guess it was Hannah Montana. And a little girl on TV was talking to an older woman on TV. And she says, is it true that you used to be a peace activist? And the older woman said, yeah, but when I started to be a peace activist, I found out that the peace activists don't even care about peace. The only reason they do that is so that the parents will get mad. Now, I promise you, that little girl right there knew it. When they sang a song on that show, she knew all the words to it. She probably had seen that episode five or six times. But if she knows the words to every song on that, something else she knows right now, for a fact, she knows that the only reason people are peace activists is to make good people mad. That's a bad thing. Man, you talk about it. We are in a dangerous world. The other day somebody told me, you know, you ought to, uh, you're, the way you talk, you ought to be a counselor for young people. And I don't want to seem like a pessimist, but I see no hope for the young people of this generation. Period. Period. I mean, even me, when I was growing up, had mind control, but I can't imagine it was that bad. Well, I, you know what? It probably was. When I was younger, we didn't ever see black people. So when I did see a black person, that was a big event for me. And the only information I was ever given about black people was that they were uh, untrainable, too stupid to learn. And so for my beginning of my life, I just knew for a fact that black people couldn't learn. So when they started bringing black people to my school, well, I was a little different than the rest. Most of them kids was like, them black people gonna ruin our school because now we ain't gonna be able to learn. In my head, I'm thinking those poor black kids, you know, what are they gonna do when us normal people are sitting here learning math and reading and writing and things like that? I mean, they just gonna watch us and wonder what we're doing? How, how in the world is that gonna affect them poor black children? Well, you probably already know the outcome of this. Uh, when I got into high school and graduated, I valedictorian and salutatorian were black. Now that right there ought to tell you something about them theories about black people not being smart. But that ain't all. I went to school with Robin Roberts. And uh, <clears throat> everybody in her family was overachiever. All her siblings, her mama, her daddy. Her, her daddy was a drove airplane back when uh, there wasn't no, no black people drove airplanes. But anyhow, this morning, as I was uh, walking out of the house, my wife's in there. She always wants to watch the media, you know, uh, Good Morning America. And there was Robin, my old 
classmate. And she was a nice person. I ain't got nothing bad to say about her. She, And she's pretty. If you look in all my high school annuals, which I don't have any, but I'm still in contact with people I went to school with, every other page, Robin Roberts, you know, most prettiest. And she was. It's a good-looking woman. I mean, you think she's good-looking now. You should have seen her when she was 18. But uh, most uh, likely to succeed, you know. Most going to make the most money. Uh, one that's going to have the most friends. Every, every other page, Robin Roberts. And the people in that town where I grew up, they all brag. The white ones, black, all of them brag. Oh, Robin Roberts, you know, grew up here. And uh, if you ask them, you know, if to just in conversation, bring up how stupid kids are today. If you ask them, why are kids so stupid today? They'll tell you, oh, it's because of integration. When they brought them black kids in, it ruined our schools because then suddenly you couldn't, could, teachers weren't allowed to teach uh, the, the right way anymore because they had to teach them poor dumb black kids. So the human mind, it does not, it does not matter uh, any what you see with your eyes. It does not matter what you experience in your life. For 99.99999 to infinity, human beings trust what they're told by the, the masses. Whatever comes on that TV, when they're five, six years old, that's what they carry with them through the rest of their life. They, the, the filters in their head that filter out stupid apparently don't work anymore. So, you know, as far as uh, when you see a video about the mass media is controlled by just a small group of companies, I want you to know just exactly what that means. 